I wanted to do the WSCT diploma course to give me a broad spectrum of different aspects of wines and also spirits, and I thought it was a very important platform for me to jumpstart uh, into the wine business from the, the career that I used to have. As part of my Liberty Apprenticeship, it's something that the company puts you through because they see it as one of the most rigorous forms of training. I wanted to enlarge my knowledge and uh, I wanted to take part in a respectable and international education system. It was a natural progression from taking level one and two and the spirits and the level three board and wine and spirits, just kind of getting in through there. I've also heard through classmates that it was, you know, kind of that next step to go in and if you were serious about it, um, to definitely take that plunge. The systematic approach to tasting um, had allowed me to apply a lot of my theoretical knowledge of wine into practice. It's very logical. It really helped me to verbalize and uh, put things into a sequence. It helped me uh, to evaluate the wine, the quality, and most importantly, the reasons. really helped me to be able to focus my answers when I'm writing about wines and to be able to write tasting notes that are much more concise. I thought the diploma was very helpful um, in that it's a world-recognised qualification. Having taken the diploma, I feel that I'm able to answer most of the questions that get thrown at me on a day-to-day -day basis um, competently and be able to not really get too phased by any of those things, particularly the tricky questions that I get asked from sommeliers. For me as a sommelier, it gives you strict guidelines uh, after which you taste every kind of wine. And in competitions, it's really important that you don't think about the structure, that you are very fast, precise with your style, vocabulary. Certainly the parts of the course that I enjoyed the most um, were Unit 3, uh, Wines of the World, because it was so fantastic to be able to taste so many brilliant wines all in the name of self-improvement. I really enjoyed meeting uh, students from all around the world at the APP where I was at. It was very international. We had people coming in from all parts of Asia, New Zealand, Australia to come in to take the course and to meet these candidates, um, do tasting with them and discuss wines, seeing from their perspective and learning about their particular markets was really, really enjoyable. It opened up a lot of opportunities for me to meet people in different aspects of the wine trade, which I really enjoyed. I think the most difficult part of the diploma is juggling the diploma with a full-time job. It is a uh, time-consuming program. You do need to put your efforts in and kind of really test your perseverance and diligence. The educators who ran the course that I really got the most out of the classes with were those who are involved in the trade directly. So, for example, um, I thought it was brilliant that our spirits teacher was someone who actually makes gins. And our... Um, Viticulture and vinification teacher was someone who's a winemaker, so she has her own vineyards and uh, makes her own wines, and so she was really able to handle all of those questions. All dedicated to their craft of educating, um, all sorts of backgrounds with loads of experience, um, able to answer all your questions, be they WSCT certified educators, masters of wine, other subject matter experts. I would recommend the diploma to anybody who has a strong interest in wine and spirits, um, someone that feel that they want to take their knowledge into a higher level, to be a more informed consumer or even a collector, and also anyone that want to transition their career into the wine trade. Any candidate who's really, really serious about wine, who wants to get in and kind of have a, a lot of confidence afterwards about um, their knowledge, and also for anyone in the wine industry who wants to set themselves apart. Um, in knowing wines, having the certification is definitely a seal of approval, um, kind of this gold standard for anyone um, working in wine and spirits. Basically, if you are really interested, anyone can do it.